Christ. You're a bloody heart failure. <laughs> you alright? Hello, I am back and today I'm taking you to see another ruin, would you believe it or not? Anyway, it is absolutely freezing, let's get straight into it. So, I'm just approaching this house to now. The name of the house is a uh, clean house. You can just make out the roof of it through the trees there. I don't know if you can see that but I don't have high expectations to get a look inside this place because as far as I'm aware it's well fenced off but still interesting to have a look at still the uh, little signs of the signs of the times back then scattered around this place like these old uh, gate posts There's a wee path runs up to the back of the house there But I'll take you guys round the front And let you see that That's the side of the house You can tell for here though, I mean it's Apart from the, the main shell, it's, it's virtually Gone But there is, I mean, see that? I do like it when I find stuff like that, like the original window frames. Can you see that up there in the the middle top window? Still got original framework. I think that's really cool. I mean when you think that that window's probably as old as the house itself. Probably original. So as you can see it's quite a quite a large country landscape area this. And it was built by a, a wealthy mine owner. Because where I am is a, it's a very rich history for mining. So you had the guy who's doing the pits, and then you had the guy who owned the pit sitting in there. There's some old pictures of this place, or a couple of them, that are available online. I'll, I'll see if I can link them to the video or if I can put a link in the description It's quite a nice picture to see But that's what's left now I mean it's a, it's a damn shame to see these places go like this I was hoping to give you a bit more history But apart from what I've already told you It's pretty much it really I think the house was intact Now don't quote me on this Because it's been a while for I looked into this place But uh, I think the house was a uh, Was an arson attack was as late as the uh, 70s And since then it's fell into obviously major disrepair it's one of the old fireplaces up in the top room there and This is an old fence inside and then this more recent fence Whoa. Wait, I'll show you this carving guys It's pretty neat Greater Butterfly Orchid That's pretty cool Here's the butterfly there Another one there Wood is such an amazing thing to work with Couple of dogs coming to say hello. 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey. Hello. I see you. Hello. <laughs> I 
I'm only glad they didn't bite me. <laughs> I'd love to come up here with a metal detector. Probably not allowed anyway, but it'd be great though. I always imagine people sitting under trees in the summer. Some old pennies and that back in the day dropping out of their pockets. Finding stuff like that's pretty cool. I do have a metal detector, but I really don't use it as much as I should. There's another good side view of the house there. Again, there's uh, quite a lot of the quite a lot of the timber timber frames and those windows. Look at that. It's pretty neat. Sun layer there as well. You can see where I'm walking. It's a bit overgrown. It is bloody bitter. It's like standing inside your freezer out here at the moment. That's more walls that are down there. Oh, you bastard! Bloody big pigeon! Excuse my language. What are you doing hiding in there? Christ. You're a bloody heart failure. <laughs> you alright? Oh, he's fine. Bit more of a closer look at the masonry work there. I'll tell you, if I was a wealthy man, I would buy places like this and restore them. This brush. Whew. Well, I think that's as close as we're going to get. So, there we go. There's a cellar level down there as well. It'll be for servants and what have you. Pretty neat. I wouldn't mind putting my boot inside there, to be honest. Just to see if there's any of the old. Uh, any of the old features inside the place, the original features, would be cool to see. It's a lovely big, heavy looking building this. Anyway, that is pretty much it. So it's like this wee uh, wildlife pond. I'm trying not to slip on my ass here. Because it's covered in ice, this walkway. Somebody's been trying to smash up the ice. That's well padlocked. But that is the old stable buildings. I'll have a wee I'll have a wee wander round a bit. To be honest, it, it looks pretty trash, so there really wouldn't be much to film in there that I can think of. And so originally that would have been the uh, the walled garden to the estate and the house. I think it's now just like a maybe a council yard or something like that. Well guys, thanks for watching, not a long explore like I said, but uh, interesting enough, I feel, hope you enjoyed it, and until next time, this is Pajerico, signing off. <laughs>